Hello everyone, welcome back to a bit more of Frostpunk with me. Let's game on, shall we? Now... Uh, last time around... What were we doing last time around? So we have some scouts that we have no idea where to send them. Uh, we have to figure out where to send these scouts. Is there, is there about to reach that? Five hours to arrive. <coughs> the, that shrouded cave. Uh, what else? We need to upgrade this. Do we have enough materials? Ah, uh, damn, I don't think we have. <coughs> Unfortunately, no, we don't. Eight more of steel. Uh, let's see, we just built this wall drill here. Which is completely inoperative, so let's get the heater on. Let's get that show on the road, shall we? Because we definitely need to up our wood intake. Oh, we are building one more house. What else? Well, <coughs> we need to keep preparing for the frost, the great frost storm. And something that I thought about was we probably should start stockpiling food as if, as if there was no tomorrow. Because um, I've got a feeling that our hunter's hut w will be rendered inoperative during that time. Now this is just a feeling... Oh, we are producing... Oh, that's right. Uh, about r roughly 350 units in excess of coal. That is not nearly good enough because we will be losing our mine. That is producing 800 of coals. Our outpost in the mine here. In the coal mine. <coughs> is currently producing 800 units of coal per day we are doing this generator efficiency that this will definitely help a steam hub with efficiency will also definitely most definitely help as as the steam hubs are the ones that are consuming the most coal so far you can see that right here yeah a thousand units per day uh, on Steam Hub, so if we can make that a little bit more efficient. RPG Addict, I'm here for the alert dude in the middle of prepping to pave my garden. First ever attempt at this. Oh, nice. Thank you so much for the support. I really appreciate it. And good luck paving your garden. Man, I wish I had a garden. I live in an apartment. <laughs> There's no way I can have a garden. But one day, one day. Uh, one day I'll be able to afford a house with a, with a small garden around it. Uh, thank you so much for the support. Uh, I think I already said that. Uh, okay, so... In the efforts of starting to stockpile food, we still got 39 unemployed workers. Uh, which means... That we should probably build some more hunter's hut. Despite us probably being good with food, right? Um, how are we doing? Yep, yeah, we can produce 440 food rations per day. We are consuming 388 per day, so we are already stockpiling. But let's up that a little bit, as we have no idea what that storm will bring us. Will make us face. Hmm. Okay. What else can we do right now before we unpause the game? We should probably send this out, these guys out. <coughs> hmm. I wonder. Exploration. No, don't abort that. No, do, do not abort that. We need it. Food and shelter. House redesign. I wonder if we'll be able to get some more people per house get some more people per house uh, with this upgrade because if we did uh, then gathering all of these uh, survivors here would be a would be a piece of cake and I kind of want to do that but the thing is I'm not sure if we have enough housing for everyone and creating another steam hub is completely out of the question as we're already burning way too much coal coal with them. 
Let's see, do we have a housing? Oh, we have housing conditions. Chilly, livable, livable, very cold. Guys, at least one worker. Oh, prison. Okay, prison counts as a house. Okay. Let's see, we have 203 inhabitants in tents. Jesus, I thought I thought we were doing better. We definitely have to build some more houses. 130 inhabitants on bunk houses and 70 on houses. We, we definitely need to keep building houses. Ooh, I just noticed this artwork here resembles a bit of a medieval uh, medieval house with the upper floor coming um, extending a little bit over the lower floor. Huh, pretty cool. That's really cool. Oh, but we are building another house there that will raise the number of house inhabitants to 80. Still not nearly good enough. Hmm. Not nearly good enough. Still, if we don't send them there, where else could we send them? Send them. Right? That's the thing. How long until we reach here? Oh, gotta select these. One day and 14 hours. 15 hours. Yeah, let's try. Yeah, let's try it. Let's try to save these guys. Probably not uh, the best of approaches, but let's try to do that. Uh, what else? Well, nothing else for now. We are stockpiling coal, aren't we? We are. Good, 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 good. So that, while we have to upgrade this, that is not the most urgent priority right now. Uh, right now we need to keep building houses and keep uh, everything running. Okay, I think we are ready to start the game. Sick are going down. Can we patrol? We will be able to patrol in just a little bit. How will we manage against that monstrosity? We won't survive this. Yes, we will. Stop doing that to yourselves. What's going on? What's going on here? Oh, shit, we need to build those hunter's huts, right? Uh, three of them should do it. Completely forgot about them. Okay, so three of them should do it. Uh, one here. Let's get another one here. And one more. One more. Um, can we build it? Oh. Okay, here. Definitely here destroy some resources it's just a couple of trees but sure um, yeah let's pull it here okay we built one more house Temperature is rising up, which means there are a few heaters that will be able to uh, turn off. Am I right? This is livable. Livable. Really? Temperature has remained at livable? What? This is still freezing. Uh, but we're not at 8 o'clock yet, so the heater hasn't turned on yet. It's still chilly. What? What? Uh, it's almost as if the temperature didn't raise, like, at all. Bunkhouse... Oh, that did make bunkhouses livable. But... Okay, houses are comfortable now. Doesn't look like there's anything we can turn off, though. happens if we turn this off? Nothing, because it's not 8 o'clock yet. Uh, oh, that's right, it's not 8 o'clock yet, which means the heaters aren't turned on yet. That's why there's no difference. Very cold, yet. Yeah, those guys definitely need those heaters. Uh, the cookhouse might not need it. 
What's this? Another cookhouse? Yeah, definitely. What else? Can, is there anything else that we can turn off? I don't think so. I don't think so. Um, so yeah, let's keep going. What happened? Uh, fear of the storm. Food theft causes riots. What? Sir, we investigated the discrepancies between the raw food use and output of the cook houses it turns out that cooks are stealing food people are furious we caught two thieves they say they wanted to secure their families before the storm shuts down the food supply banish them no Jesus Christ no post guys to supervise the cooks I want to address this right now you know what, um, as always these are people, they made a mistake but we need them to contribute to our city. So let's post the guards to supervise the cooks. So that everyone can have food. Uh, the sick are rising a little bit. Uh, the infirmary is boosted. This is boosted. Medical posts, all of these lovely medical posts are boosted. So yeah. It can't accelerate the healing process right now, but we'll see. Let's see. Okay, that is cold, but it is sustaining, which is good. Which is good. Uh, we should also build another. Another. Uh, Workshop tech. Workshop. Where are the workshops? Uh, there they are. Now let's build a street. How are the. Okay, they're being built. The. Hunters, the hunt houses are being built, so we will be able to staff them before the end of the day. Ooh, we are gathering food at, uh, food, not food, wood, at an astonishing rate. Let's boost that. Can we boost these guys? No. Can we boost these guys? Most definitely can. Um, what should be our top priority right now? Getting this technology done, right? These guys are boosted, that's under construction. Okay, we will be able to boost these guys in just a little bit. Not sure why that's at 20%, probably because we're building so much stuff. Scouts have reached children's hideouts. Oh no, survivors, but they're only children. Oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> oh man, I not sure if we can ah we'll have to make space for them somehow not sure how um, let's see is there a ho there is a housing overlay do we know how many people vacant beds 32 16 in care house so we can if that's not too many children we can accommodate them this is gonna get tough again uh, but sure let's do it explore we walked to the children in the hideout. They said that one night their teachers and some hunters took them out from Winter Home on a secret adventure. Teachers told them that they're going to stay here for a while. When the food ran low, their guardians went back to get more and didn't return. It seemed these kids were evacuated in time before things in, in their city got really ugly. Okay. Escort. Oh man, these are 34 children. Not knowing, we'll die trying to find it. Uh, we'll have to have to escort them, right? 
It's the only it's the only thing to do. Uh, we form the children 34 into an orderly column and set off towards the city. They walk quietly and resolutely, little like like little adults, the youngest clutching their toys tightly. This is going to be a long journey. Please have enough warm beds prepared for their arrival. Um damn. Okay, we have one day to take care of that. Damn. Damn, we'll need to take care of those children. Uh, 32. We don't have enough beds. Uh, I definitely don't have enough, not nearly enough warm beds. We'll need to keep building more houses. Um, we also need to gather materials. Get that research going. Okay, no need. Cannot boost that yet. Can we go on a patrol? We can. Get hope up and discontent down. Alright, let's get to work, people. Let's get to work faster. Alright, we need that research going. We are gathering, gathering a lot of materials, I like it. And we are stockpiling a bit more coal, which will definitely come in handy in the days to come. Um, so yeah. Alright, we can start staffing uh, the workhouse, the hunter's huts, right? Where are... This is the other one, right? Okay, so how are we doing on food now? Okay, so we are producing 520 units per day and consuming nearly 400 units per day. That's 120 units plus uh, per day left over. Uh, that's pretty cool. That's That's pretty cool. Sick? Can we boost? Uh, is there any medical posts that we can boost? Definitely. Let's see here. Definitely. Uh, can't boost this one yet. Okay, that's it for now. That is all we can boost for now. What looms ahead? Twelve percent. Okay, sick are going down, which is great news. Absolutely great news. Oh, we're almost done with that. Okay, good thing that we're stockpiling a lot, a lot of materials, so that we can start researching uh, those very expensive ones that we can. Alright. Huh? Another achievement. Have four workshops doing research in Oxbridge. Okay, cool. Uh, cool. Let's boost them. Alright. Difference engines. Um, researched. So, infirmary checklists. Uh, infirmaries will heal people 50% faster. Nope. Houses will cost 10 wood and 10 steel less to build. Huh. That's not, not what I was hoping for. Not what I was hoping for. I mean, good nonetheless, as we can build more houses with less materials. But definitely not what what I was hoping for um, so yeah what did we unlock here gathering post insulation we don't have any gathering posts so that's not needed now is it advanced steel works oh okay 
allows us to build advanced steelworks, uh, extracts iron from deep deposits, to manufacture up to 130 steel per standard workday, and these guys manufacture 70, okay, so again, nearly double, but nearly, nearly doubles. Now, should we start researching something to face the cold right now? Uh, probably generator efficiency. Generator coal consumption will be reduced by a further 10%. Improved heaters, advanced heaters. Advanced heaters raise the temperature of workplaces by three levels. Each heater consumes three coal per hour when running. And this is two coal per hour when running. Still, these guys are not uh, the ones that consume the most heat. You know what? Let's go for the housing. I think that's that's the one. Ooh, coal mining rationalization. Coal mines, steam coal mines, and advanced coal mines will be another 10% more efficient. We definitely need this. Um, we definitely need that. Let's let's first go for the house redesign. So that we can build more houses with less resources. Speaking of which, uh, we can start building more houses, right? People, house, okay. Let's see the temperature overlay. So, yeah, let's replace this that tent over there. Let's replace that tent so we can actually build one more. Oh, we probably should go. We probably should go for the for the storm research thingy. Also, probably. Why is this at twenty eight percent? Okay, let's see if we can boost any more of these medical posts and infirmaries. We can boost this one. Okay, let's boost them. Okay. Seven sick, six sick. That's great, actually. Did we figure out? Oh wait, no. This does not leave anything. Anything left there? Oh man. Hope we have enough houses for the children. I'm not sure if we do, and we don't really have a plan to do them. Ooh, nice, three sick. We're almost with no sick left. That's great. Great news all around. Right, we probably need another depot for one sick. That's great. That's the best result in a very long time. It's the best result in a very long time. We're starting to build another house. We got 125 of steel. Uh, that means that we can build yet another house. Right, and still remain with a hundred of steel. So yeah, let's keep going for these lovely, lovely houses. Because we will definitely need them to face the upcoming storm. I just put a post out on my Discord urging people to chip for your stream. Oh, thank you so much, RPG Addict. Really appreciate it. Uh, we are getting close. Uh, I'm really, we're really getting close to affiliate now. Uh, before starting this stream, we were we were at 2.6 uh, average. Uh, this one's doing a little more poorly as with two viewers for most of the time. So yeah, one or two more viewers would be great for that. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Okay, so some more survivors. Long way down. Those people must have fallen this hole while escaping the incoming storm. At least half of them didn't survive the crash, but it seems we could rescue the wounded. That is, if we strap them to our sleds and bring them our city 
quickly. Camp. Okay, not too many, uh, but some workers, which is good. Okay. Um, we will need more houses. Oh shit, we got four homeless. Oh, but that's because we destroyed we destroyed two houses, that's okay. These guys will not be homeless for long. These guys will not be homeless for long. What else? There are the hunters going out for hunt, bringing lots and lots of food for our city. to replace another tent with a house. Right, good. Let's do it. House. Haven't we researched? We have not. Uh, so, let's see. The tents are all at the same temperature, right? So, any any tent that we replace is a good thing. So, yeah. Let's, let's do it then. Patrol? Not yet. Okay, what's going on? Doom-mongering drunks. Sir, a dozen or so people got drunk and took to the streets. They were chasing after women, yelling that we should have some fun before the storm kill us all. What should we do with them? Banish them. Twelve people will to see for them. Send them home. They will be sent to sober up, but their doom-mongering will affect hope and discontent. Oh, come on. Why? Hey, CJW Racing! Hello! Welcome to the stream! Thank you so much for watching! Really appreciate it! Uh, how are you doing today, my friend? Uh, are you a streamer too? Come on, these people made a mistake. They don't need to be banished. Uh, let's send them home. We will de we'll deal with uh, hope and discontent loss. as soon as we can go on another patrol. See the temperature overlay. Okay, that's one more house built. Let's see, how are we doing? We're still doing great on food. We're still... Ah, we're not doing that great on coal for some reason. Efficiency dropped. Um, for some, probably because we turned on another heat, another heater. Let's see. How are we doing on housing? We got bunk houses, care house. It's cold in the prison, but there's nobody there. Tent. Got a hundred on houses, 174 on tents. Most of our popu population is still on tents. So. As soon as we get this done, good man. I'll be streaming late tomorrow. Just here to check it out. Oh, thank you so much. Really appreciate it. What are you streaming right now? C CJW Racing. Let's get the game going a little bit faster. There's nothing to do. Nothing to decide at night. Okay. Tesla City is already freezing. Uh, which means... We'll, we will have to recall these guys soon enough. Okay. 
need to start going for coal and efficiencies and all those lovely, lovely upgrades. How will we manage against that monstrosity? We will manage somehow, don't worry, my friend. We are stockpiling food. Uh, oh, there it is. Temperature will drop one level. Now we know when the storm is going to hit. Okay. How many days do we have to research that? That should probably... Okay. Next, let's research that storm and then we'll start going for heat and stuff like that. Efficiency upgrades, all that good stuff. Uh, is there a workshop that we can boost? I do sim racing commentary. Oh, that's actually very interesting. I'll need to, I'll, I'll need to check it out. How good does this game look, <laughs> CGW Racing? I'll need to check it out. I like I like the idea of racing. I'm terrible at it, but I do I definitely like the idea. We cannot boost any more research centers, but we are doing this very, really, really fast. Ooh, CJW, CJW Racing, thank you so much for the follow, man. Really appreciate it. Let me return that as I am interested in the racing. There we go. Really appreciate it. Really appreciate it. You rock. I uh, have returned to our city. Okay. Nobody's homeless though, which is good. Which is good. So it was a good thing that we didn't send them all the way out to Tesla City. Camp Compass, yeah, we will not make it there in time. We will not, definitely not make it there in time. But these guys are coming back, so we're about to run out of, you know, um, houses. So yeah, um, so yeah, but we can start building more, it's probably a good idea to start building more, oh we can squeeze a house here, yeah definitely, definitely squeeze a house there, uh, we can, is there anyone else that we can squeeze a house? over here somewhere. Nope. Aside from the upgrades. So we can upgrade some... Uh, yeah, actually, let's do that. Let's definitely upgrade another tent into a house. We'll probably need to get rid of this sawmill. Uh, oh, it is... It just it can just gather 17 more wood anyway, so we will need to get rid of it anyways. Then we can build a few more houses over there. Um, should we get them? 12 hours, 10 hours. I guess we could get them there. Try to save these guys. It looks class. I really need to get into more RPGs. Um, it's not really an RPG though. <laughs> it is a, stra a strategy game slash city builder. That's okay. Uh, let's see here. 10 units of wood. Let's make sure... Okay, we're almost done with that. Nice. How's redesign? Researched. Okay. Now our main priority is the cold. 11 hours, coal mining, rationalization. Mm, coal mines, steam coal mines, okay, 10% more efficient. Uh, ooh, additional scouts, okay, no need for that right now. 10% uh, efficiency, okay, so I think we gain more by, by researching the coal efficiency. Yeah, I think that's the first one we need to do, this is 11. How many hours does this take? 11 hours, 9 hours. Uh, let's go. 
for coal mining rationalization. Because this is the one that will make the biggest impact right now. So definitely start that. I got a nip off. Enjoy, I'll pop back next time. Oh, thank you so much for dropping by. I'll see you soon, my friend. Thank you so much for the support. Uh, let's see. Ah, damn it. No, 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 no. That's not the one we need. Abort, abort, abort. Did we get the resources back? We did. We need to do this one first. Because we, we definitely need to know what we're going, or what is coming our way. Let's see, can we gather a bit more steel? Nope. Can we... Uh, where are the workshops? Here they are. Is there any workshop that we can boost? Nope. Do we have the engineers to spare? Uh, barely. Okay, so yeah, this is inoperative as there are no more resources to gather. Let's Let's destroy it, so that we can build some houses there instead. Okay, so 34 children and 31 homeless. Great! Great. That's just great. Uh, can we build three houses there? Uh, actually, one is already being built. We might just be able to build two of them, so barely. We might do it barely, right? Uh, I do have a sneeze coming up. Seems like it didn't. It didn't come up. Uh, okay, so... Camp Compass. A small camp built around a larger Arctic hut. It's inhabited. We saw movement during the day and lights at night. Oh, so more survivors. Great! Ah, we need to accommodate them all somehow. Uh, let's get them off to the snow burrows, I guess. No need to get them back down there. Okay, so there is the fact that we, we lost a home there. Seven people are freezing. Okay, 21 are out of a house, but that one will give us a bit more housing. So that's okay. Stay. Can we boost any workshops? No, we cannot. Uh, but maybe... Oh, hungry. Why are you hungry? There's plenty of food, mate. There's really no short shortage of food. Can we go on a patrol? We can. Okay. Uh, let's build some houses. build one. Can we only... Can we build another one here? Oh, damn. We can only build one. Damn. Hot damn. One will have to be enough. Unfortunately. <sighs> At least until invalid placement location. There is a bit of space that it's that is not being fully utilized there, so maybe maybe we can do that. We might need to use some 24 hour hour shifts for the for the engineers as well. Okay. That's 31 homeless. These guys are waiting outside. Let's 
see. Let's see here. What else can we do? What else can we do? We have the engineers to spare. We got four engineers, so yeah, let's definitely build uh, another workshop. This is where the workshops are, right? Yeah. Let us definitely build another workshop. Can we boost... Can we boost any of the workshops? Well, we will be able to boost a couple of them in a little while, so let's definitely do that. Okay. We can also boost this one. Let's keep going at a nice research pace. So that we don't have to uh, go for the 24 hour work shifts, right? Right, let's get those houses built, people, shall we? Oh, Sorin in the Great, hi, welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for watching. How are you doing today, my friend? How's your weekend going? Okay, we got a house built over there. These two houses will take care of most of the homeless, but not all. Uh, which sucks. Which sucks. We definitely need those efficiency upgrades. Okay, you know what? Uh, we're gonna take this opportunity and build there the steam steam coal mine so that it's upgraded by the start of the next workday what happened looks like something happened these guys are waiting ah more survivors hot damn we have no more space for survivors unfortunately I'm great well that's that's wonderful news my friend I'm so glad I'm so glad that that is the case. We don't have space for any more survivors. Damn. We definitely just don't have the space. Mm, what should we do? What should we do? Should we risk it and bring them back to the city? Should we not risk it? Uh, let's... Uh, okay, here's what we're gonna do. Let's create a save game here. And then we'll risk it, bringing them back. Because that is the right thing to do. And if that turns out to be terrible, uh, we'll just, you know, do the other thing. <laughs> on the verge of death. These people are on their last legs. Despite taking shelter in a nice uh, crevice... Uh, crevice? Uh, many of them suffer from heavy frostbite and hypothermia. We can help them still if we act quickly and bring them to our city. They can't stand on their own. They can hardly speak. Bring them to our city. Good strategy. Yeah, thanks. Uh, we are trying to improve this a little bit. We won't be able to save these guys like at all. Because a storm is coming. Uh... But we will try to pull these guys out. Although we don't have any more houses, but hopefully with the with the coal that will be the extra coal that we'll be extracting, we'll be able to create another steam hub, and maybe just maybe we'll be able to do it. We'll see. What's being built there? Oh, uh, the workshop. Right. People call it safe scum. I call it being smart. <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, it is smart because at the end of the day, 
the number of people that you have is uh, determines how much you can do with the city and that is good the only problem here is that we don't have any more space to create more houses but um, we will we will be we will be able to overcome that i believe uh, astonishing gaming 93 yo ninja yo astonishing gaming how are you doing today thank you so much for watching uh, welcome to the stream thank you so much so much for dropping by really appreciate it okay Okay, and we will still have one homeless spite. Oh, Astonishing Gaming, thank you so much for the follow. You rock! <laughs> really appreciate that support. <sighs> Are you a streamer too, Astonishing Gaming? Okay, and we are starting to build, uh, upgrading the mine, which will definitely help with our situation. We still have one homeless. We definitely need those upgrades. So as soon as, uh, as soon as the storm thinning, the stereoscopic lenses are are researched, we definitely need to go for upgrading our our steam hubs and all that good stuff. And great stream, mate. And yes, man, I am. Oh, great! Uh, make sure to check him out then. What do you stream, Ast astonishing gaming? I'm in the RPG Discord as Aston. Oh, <laughs> oh, I remember you. Yeah, I know who you are. Definitely. You're Aston. Uh, now we have four homeless. Okay, we'll definitely need... Uh, how are we doing coal-wise? Uh, actually, those numbers will not be great because this is not done yet. Uh, yeah, we definitely need a new steam hub. There's just no way around it. Just no way around it. Okay, let's see how the coal numbers are doing. Okay, uh, we have 780 units to spare per day, which might sound great, but it's not nearly good enough because due to the storm, we will have to have stop to stop operations in this coal mine, which produces 800 units per day. So yeah. Uh, really sorry, but I have to go. Really busy today with everything. Have a great day. Hey, no worries, mate. I really appreciate you dropping by. Have a great day. Have a great weekend. Thank you so much for, for watching. So, yeah. Uh, Steam still works. This is very cold. We'll definitely need to create a new steam hub. Let's just check if we can if we can squeeze a house somewhere. If there's a, a wee bit of space anywhere. We'll definitely need to take take it. What's this? This is an infirmary. Okay. This is a cook house. There might be some space here. But it's not in range of the of the steam hub. So we can either increase range of the steam hubs, or we can create a new one altogether. How much coal does do the steam hubs um, consume? Let's see. Um, health, maybe no tech. Yeah, tech. Uh, active steam hub consumes three coal per hour. Okay, that's that doesn't sound too bad actually. Doesn't sound too bad. So we can get one here and get this uh, this wall drill heated up so that people don't get too sick uh, when they go there. 
and then create some houses around it and then definitely go for the upgrades for the coal upgrades for the coal efficiency and, and that that sort of thing let's do that uh, but first uh, I need to take a short five minute break uh, I will be right back thank you all for watching we'll be right back
Alright, and we are back. Thank you so much for waiting. Thank you so much for watching. Um, let's get right back into it, shall we? Uh, so, what were we doing? Right, we were deciding to place a new steam hub over there and to rescue these guys. Oh, not to rescue. We already decided to rescue these guys, so yeah. Um, so yeah, let's build that steam hub. Let's build that steam hub, shall we? Severe frostbite. Damn. Another amputee. So now we have five. Is that it? Should probably go for the factory as well. Or a factory. Okay. This is the last day before temperature drops. Okay. A group of barely, barely alive people hiding in s several burrows dug into piles of snow. The price of survival. All well, these people are deathly ill. It's a wonder that they're still alive. The snow burrows are only a little less freezing than the surrounding icy wasteland. They won't last a day if we don't take them right now to the city. Camp Meteor. Okay, some more workers. Bring the sick to our city. Definitely. How long will, will you take? So a couple of hours until these guys arrive, and 11 hours until those guys arrive. So we definitely need uh, the steam hub up and running sooner rather than later. Uh, and can we get some more engineers over there? Oh, we can. Okay. Let's use the workers, as we do have a lot of workers right now. And fully staff that workshop. Have the engineers to spare? Nope, just the one. Just the one. Okay, people are starting to to build that steam hub. Let's build the steam hub first, and then we'll decide where to place the houses. sick, we should be able to tend them. Okay, so, so no need to worry there. Temperature will drop one level and this is the storm. The great storm that is looming. Okay. Oh, this is turned on 24 hours a day. So let's start building houses. Uh, valid placement location. Can we, can we just wait a bit until we have the full radius? Okay, so that we can see what we're dealing with. Alright. Oh. Is that it? No, the radius will still grow a bit, right? Okay. Uh, how about now? Okay, there we go. Okay, so yeah, definitely build one there. Uh, build another one here. I guess that's it. Let's accumulate a few more resources and then... And then we'll... Uh, build some more houses. Alright, scouts have returned safely to the city. 
with seven children and twelve workers. How are we doing coal-wise? Yeah. Yeah, we're just barely, not even 500 units of coal per day to spare. So yeah, we definitely need those efficiency upgrades and all that good stuff. Why is there nobody building those houses? Oh, the workers are getting there. Okay, we do have 34 of steel, but let's wait until we finish this research. Together a bit more steel. Come, lads. We must work harder. Oh, wait, these guys are waiting. Um, Camp Meteor, one day and nine hours. Um, hmm. <laughs> probably, probably should be, should not be sending them out anymore. Uh, let's have them wait. We have the workers to spare. We do have the workers to spare, so... Let's create a few more, um, a few more hunter's huts. Okay, a couple more then. Build um, food so that we can stockpile. Stockpile a bit more of, a bit more of food. Let's build them here, I guess. Maybe here. And probably here. Yeah. Alright. Place to go. Okay. This is for wood. Uh, it's always for wood. Okay. It's always for wood. Definitely need to boost uh, these guys. Oh, we got it. We got one sick absence. Can we boost another one of these workshops? We will be able to boost that one in a, a short bit. Uh, let's see here. Going to treatment. Let's boost the infirmaries as we are gathering a lot of patients. Max, one available. Yeah, let's start boosting. These lovely, lovely med posts and infirmaries. Okay, and another one. Ooh, yet another one. Boy, we have a lot of medical posts. We spent a lot of food doing that. That's okay though. That's, can we get hope up? Not yet. Alright, what's going on there? Prayers at work. Sirs, the people employed at this workshop refuse to work today. They intend to spend the entire shift praying. What? Uh, we've been working like madmen, sir, but there's only so much we can do to prepare. Let's face it, this is the end of the world. Uh, through prayer, we can find hope of deliverance, whatever happens. Force them to work, hope will fall. Let them pr pray. Pray. This workplace will be inactive for the day. Um, no, man. Uh, we need you to work. We need you to research. We're depending on that. Sorry, mate. We can deal with the hope falling, but Jesus. We need this research done ASAP. And you're not doing a great job at it either. Uh, okay, we can boost this work. This temperature will drop today. <laughs> Finally, okay. The beacon can now gauge the severity of incoming storms. Uh, 
what does that mean? What does that mean, though? Hmm. Well, screw that. We need to start to get on the on the coal mine oh, rationalization. to get that show on the road. Prepare for the storm. Sir, the scientists couldn't believe their eyes, but they've double and triple checked their calculations. They say the strongest winds of the storm will cause the temperature to plummet beyond anything we've ever experienced before. Hunting will be impossible, I knew it. Uh, the plants in hot houses will freeze, everyone left outside the city will perish, and so will we if we can't hit our homes properly, we have to prepare. Hope falls. Okay. Um, that's why we are building more hunting huts. And stockpiling food. And stockpiling food, right? And as long as we can keep uh, the coal running, that will be good enough, I guess. How's this doing? This is little. Okay, let's get that there. To save a, a wee bit more coal. Not too much, but a wee bit. Hmm. I knew it, so my predictions were correct. We will not be able to hunt anymore. We will not be able to produce food, actually. So yeah, we definitely need uh, as many hunters as we can spare right now, so that we can bring as much food as we can right now. Maximum number of expeditions reached. We have food for a little over a day, right? 600. Uh, yeah, raw food gain 300 a day. We have food. Ah, how are we going? I mean, we have to go like two or three days without hunting? How are we going to do that? Oh man, we definitely need to build more houses. That's a minor concern compared to what's looming. We don't have any more workers to spare, but we'll have we will have some more workers uh, soon. Why is this a twenty-eight percent for sick absences? What the hell, man? What the hell? One sick absence. Ah, how are we going to get that, gather that much food? Prepare for the storm. Recall all scouts and outpost teams. Two days to do that. Okay. Survivors. Rescue survivors from the boroughs. Okay. That's good. Colts, research generator power upgrade 3. Uh, and we have two days to do that. Where is power upgrade 3? Oh shit, we're gonna have to do this. 150. So we will need some 24 hour shifts <laughs> on research. Mike 187, yo, Nevsh. Hello, Mike 187. Welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for dropping by. Okay, so now uh, we know that we're not uh, preparing food. Gather at least a week's worth of food for each citizen. A total of. Oh my god, how are we going to do that? How are we going to do that? There's just no way. 
There is just no way uh, in two days that we can gather one week of food. Holy moly. We're dead. <laughs> We're dead. I mean, uh, we can't recall the, the guys. We can't save these guys. Uh, there's just no way we can we can do that. Um, okay, but let's try it anyways. Uh, we need one... Okay, need one steam core for this, for the hothouse, uh, this will make a bit more food, um, yeah, yeah, uh, we're going for the coal mining rationalization, not sure, I'm no longer sure if that's what we need, because food is, uh, we need to upgrade food, man. We just need to upgrade food. RPG Addict looks very busy now that making progress. <laughs> yeah, we are making progress, but we just found out that we don't have nearly enough food to outlast the, um, the incoming storm. Uh, we don't even have enough food stores for them, for everyone. So yeah, hmm. <laughs> it's not gonna end well. Um, so yeah, uh, screw that. Boards. Food is our top priority right now. Food is our top top priority right now, which means uh, no need for this because because we don't have any. We don't have any any steam cores left to spare. Um, we definitely need this. We're going to start having 24 hour shifts on these workshops. Damn, I can't believe these guys wanted to spend a whole day praying. What's what's your average now? Uh, I haven't checked. Uh, before starting this stream was 2.6 viewers for the last 30 days. I haven't checked during this stream yet. Okay, scout unit number T have, have returned safely to the city. 11, uh, 11 workers. That's good. Survivors rescue. We saved everyone we could from the places we knew were still sheltering survivors. God help the rest. Hope rises. Good. Good. need to build a couple more houses that's okay though because we do have that covered yeah, a couple more houses should do it How's everyone doing in the chat? Uh, do you have any plans for the weekend? Oh, we need to staff this. Flying hunters researched. Okay, good. Uh, let's keep going. Flying Hunter's Gear, thanks to better weapons and enhanced detection, Hunters setting out from Hunter's Hangar will return with more raw food each hunt, up to 45 raw food per hunt. Uh, yeah, but that's not nearly good enough. It's not nearly good enough, and that's assuming that we can build a shit ton of Flying Hunters. Uh, let's see, can we? Oh god, 40... Forty wood and forty steel. Oh god, we don't have those resources. Um, what else can we do for food? Um, 
all right all digging up done and now off off to buy mod surface all right good pretty cool have to show us a picture of your of your garden after all that <laughs> really curious to see the end result uh, oh god okay let's do what we can I mean I didn't know we, we wouldn't be able to to hunt I mean I was expecting us not to be able to hunt but I wasn't expecting the hot houses to not produce any food at all like at all we need to build hunters hangars how many can we build one right Yep, that just the one. Four sick absences. Hot damn. And we will also kneel need to Oh no it's not. Uh you guys are going for twenty four hour shifts. Sorry, I'm sorry, my friends. You absolutely have to. This content's still rising. Let's lower this content a little bit. Get hope up. Uh, but you guys definitely need to keep researching. Otherwise, we won't make it. guys let's get the building all that building done okay uh, oh children can work here okay it's, it's great actually this produces how much one raw food what one raw food we still don't have enough materials to build another one of these okay what's going on Apathy sets in. Sir, people you ordered to stay yet for another emergency shift are working very slowly. After so many hours of toil, they've become apathetic. They don't see how we can survive the storm, no matter how well we prepare. This content will rise slightly. Let them be. This workplace will operate at 50% efficiency during the emergency shift. I'm sorry, guys. You, 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 you have to double down. Uh, you absolutely have to double down. There's just no other way. And even if you do double down, uh, there's no guarantees that we'll survive. That's how how bleak things are, are looking. Uh, 10 out of 10. Upgrade in progress. Okay, we can upgrade another one. Let's upgrade another one. How are 18 people homeless? Oh, no roads toward that, towards that house. Okay. Alright. 30 wood per day. Uh, 30 raw food per day. Together more steel. The automaton is working there. Oh wow! We are about 21 available. Oh, this is setting off. These guys are not setting off for some reason. going how are we going to 
to make that much food. There's just no way, man. There's just no way. We still have to up our food count a lot. There's just no way. Um, how much is that producing, that hot house? 30 units per day. Okay, nothing. Uh, wait. Probably can. So, yeah. Spend 10, 10 food to get that going. Flying Hunter's Gear research, okay. Good. Now we are gathering yet more food. Is there anything else we can do for food? I don't think so. Uh, because we cannot build any hot houses, anyways. Um, so yeah. Cook house insulation. We we'll probably need that. don't have nearly enough materials to start researching this. Let's see, can we research any of this? Nope. Hot damn. We don't even have enough materials to research anything. How are we doing on food? Doesn't really matter though. Um, okay, we're stockpiling 400 units per day. And we have two days until the storm hits. That means we'll be able to stockpile 800 units. Great, not nearly enough for the <laughs> oh almost 3k units that we're, we're going to need. Ah, desperate times, desperate times. this last a week. Oh man, everybody's just gonna die. Street is not connected to the generator. What? So that's why nobody was leaving there. start some more research. Ooh. Ooh, Gamer Tropy. Gamer Topi, thank you so much for the follow. Really appreciate it. You rock. <laughs> uh, Gamer Tropy, primal support. Thank you so much. Really, really appreciate it. Ooh. Primal, primal is a great, great streaming community. Really appreciate it. So, I guess you're a, you're a streamer too, Gamer Topi? What do you stream? We can go for the generator efficiency upgrade or the steam hub. Or maybe we can go back to the coal mining. Oh, we don't have enough resources for that. Two cold insulation, we'll definitely need that. What are the priorities? Okay, uh, heat zones around steam hubs can be extended 15% further. Note, steam hub will consume twice as much coal when this setting is active. Sorry about that. Um, don't really need that, but we do need uh, the efficiency for the steam hubs. Warframe. Oh, nice. Next is Frostpunk. Oh, <laughs> cool. Can't wait to see how you play this. Um, uh, we are in a very, for the third time since we start, since I've started playing this game, we are in a very tough situation where <laughs> we'll have to gather a shit ton of food with no way of doing that um, until the time limit. So yeah, yeah, <laughs> we're in a pickle right now. Uh, 
so generator efficiency maybe or the steam hub maybe This will have to get done either way. It's just no more. Nothing else we can do, I guess. What's going on? Fight over supply. Sir, an argument erupted between some workers last night. Some of them wanted a portion of the resources their facility produces so they can prepare for the storm. It came to blows and though nobody was seriously injured, tensions are running high. Keep me updated. Discontent is rising. Right. Haven't played Warframe in a very, very long time. How is the game doing? right now hmm. not much we can do right except wait there's a 10% for some reason If we can build, nope. Um, yeah, we still got thirteen homeless. How? Thought we had built enough houses. Oh well, all of the resources must go towards making these hunter's huts and flying huts. So yeah, not much we can do right now. We won't survive this. Ah, you're probably right. You have to prepare if you want to have stand any chance of survival. Falls. Okay, let's wait for the temperature to fully drop and then we'll assess the damage. Let's see. This is cold. The hot house is cold. Uh, tent, uh, tents are cold. Okay, but we're still doing cookhouse is cold so let's turn that on let's turn that on for that other cookhouse hot house uh, let's turn that on I guess this is cool so we'll turn this on as well our researching steam hub range upgrade right guys Let's get to work. Ooh, hope is dropping dramatically. Alright, what else can we research? Steam hubs will burn 33% less coal. That is definitely what we need, but we don't have any, nearly enough resources to do that. A mob storms the stockpile. Sir, a crowd of terrified people has stormed the stockpiles and started plundering supplies. We managed to fight them off, but they demand wood for heating and reinforce their homes. We need a thousand wood to supply everybody. What? We'll have wood for everyone. No, we won't. Disperse the crowd. Uh, discontent will rise. The city comes first. Uh, people may get hurt. Sorry, we don't have nearly enough... Nearly enough. Um. Oh, what are we doing? We should definitely go for the soup. We should definitely go back for the soup. We definitely need that. So, now we can multiply our rations for a factor of 2.5 instead of 2. That means. What does that mean? We are gaining a thousand per day, so 500 of storage. Ah, we just might be able to barely do it. If we can upgrade, um, if 
we can upgrade this. If we can upgrade some more some more of these guys, uh, we just might be able to do it. Just barely. Uh, we will need... <sighs> Actually, we won't be able to do it as this is the last night that we... That we can we can hunt for food. So yeah, even with that, um, it won't be enough. It won't be nearly enough. We don't have 50 wood for the people. God damn it! Let's save the game again. Okay, so this is the last uh, couple of days that we'll be able to produce food. Uh, we are going to get... Can we do... No, we cannot. I'm sorry, mates. We're gonna have a 24-hour shift here. With efficiency, when it... to make more of these. 11 hours left? What do you mean? Are we not doing good on the coal department? Oh shit, we are not. We are definitely not. Why not though? Mm, let's see. Resources. Large resource depot. need that. Uh, the coal is the least of my concerns though. Right now the coal is the least of my concerns. We definitely need... Uh, we need that so and we don't have the resources so let's just get the game rolling shall we? can we do? Can we build another one of these flying thingies? No. We cannot. Uh, okay, so where is that wall drill? Here it is. We definitely need you working. Um, we decrease the efficiency because we will need... We will need to build more of these guys. Right? So, cost 25 wood and 40 steel. Uh, yeah, sure. Can we build another one? No. We cannot. Can we upgrade? Uh, we can. Okay. Efficiency. Let's up that efficiency. Because we definitely need to gather enough materials and raw food. Okay, um, can build another one, another hunter's hangar, okay, good, uh, let's get that over with, can we build another depot, resources, resource depot, nope, we cannot, we have to deal with what we have, which is not much. have 80 wood nearly enough steel can we go on a patrol not yet to get that 
amount of lost by the citizen became gravely ill. That's okay though. I don't think... Hunter's Hangar, shall we? Okay. This has to be operating sooner rather than later. Do we have enough materials to research something we do? Let's see. Start that. We might need yet another twenty four hour shift. Uh, we okay, hope rises a bit, discontent drops a lot. Alright, how are we doing on food? How? how? How did we upgrade so many? So many and we're still just producing uh, 500 raw food. <sighs> okay, let's make another depot. Make another depot, resource depot. So that we can stockpile some more raw food. So that we have enough to convert into, into rations. food 545 units per day uh, not nearly good enough but it was what we were able to do uh, we need to recall how are we doing coal wise not great we also need to recall um, these guys this mental outpost Go back to our city, 13 hours to arrive. And now, coal is a major concern, right? Oh, it's not actually. Okay. It's actually not. Hmm. Okay. Um, so, yeah. What are we researching? Steam hub efficiency upgrade. Yeah, definitely. We definitely need that. And hopefully... Uh, hey, thank you so much! I'll definitely try to go longer on this stream to even out the average. Oh, thank you so much RPG Addict. Really appreciate that support. I think uh, we have... Well, I'm not sure, obviously. We have been doing... Oh. So yeah, maybe we can get another night, another night where we uh, where we still hunt. So we definitely need that upgrade. Uh, we can build another. We can 
build another hunter's hangar. Uh, not adjacent to a street, no need. And then staff it to try to gather some more food. Though I do believe it won't be nearly enough. But we'll see. Everyone hosts. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, with the with the viewers we have right now, I think we might be over the three viewer average for this stream, which is good enough, you know. Uh, good enough. I think we can build another house, though. Can we not? No, not a bunk house. An actual house. Yeah, we definitely can. Wait, are these guys... Oh, that's why we're, we're consuming so much coal. These guys went for the range upgrade. No need for that. No need for that. I thought some, something was fishing. Okay, so... One, one... No need for the range upgrade, my friends. No need for that. Okay, so this should have gotten us to not consume nearly as much coal. Uh, we'll see. We shall see. resources <laughs> okay so not not much else we can do tonight aside from you know building that well, frostbite a citizen became gravely ill we do have the infirmaries to deal with that so yeah let's get those guys out hunting for, for food for us. Uh, let's see, how are we doing food-wise? 590 per day. Uh, <laughs> it's hard to do the math. I don't think we, we have enough. We have 500, 500 rations plus about 100 raw food, which will yield uh, 250 rations so that means that we're at 700 and something right now 700 uh, roughly around 800 rations and with today we will be able to make we will be able to make 590 food we'll be able to make 600 not 600 no wait a uh, thousand one hundred and eighty plus half of that. I need a calculator <laughs> for that. <laughs> Hi, Della Rocco. Welcome, welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for coming, and thank you so much for moderating this stream. I'm off out now, so I apologize if my view knocks off. I only have fifteen percent phone battery. That's okay, man. I really appreciate appreciate all the support you gave me so far. That's more than enough, really more than enough. Thank you so much. Thanks, Madman Welshi, here for the RPG Discord, sharing the Madman support. Thank you so much, Madman, really appreciate that support. We're definitely going for affiliate. Um, thank you so much, yeah. Uh, make sure to follow each other. Yes, let's definitely do that. I think. I'm already following the madman, am I not? Let's let's check that right now. Uh, let's actually check that right now. Yep, I'm already following him. And also let's get that calculator out. I use the phone as a calculator. Oh. Okay, so 590 raw food times 2.5 that's a thousand four hundred and seventy five units rations plus 
Uh, how, ma how many do we have right now? 542. 542. 542. That equals 2017. We need to some 2077, and we'll we'll be able to produce 200, roughly 250 rations out of these. So we'll, we're still short. We are definitely still short, uh, but not as short as we were. Not nearly as short as we were. We're all trying to help each other grow. No problem, always sharing the Mad Men support. Thank you so much, really appreciate it. Okay, so we barely got enough food. We almost have enough food for everybody, but we are out of resources. We could issue a 24 hour. 24 hour shift there. Uh, we probably will need to do that. Probably will need to do that as the the hunters uh, do go through throughout the day, so one more should do it. Uh, yeah, so more discontent, but what are you gonna do? 24 hour shift there. Uh, can we go on a walk? Nope, we cannot. As we do need to hunt some more, we almost have enough enough rations. What's this? A sawmill. We don't need that sawmill. We almost have enough raw raw, raw rations to outlast the week. Almost. Uh, I think we need I think we need 24 hour shift here too. Sorry guys. Content is rising, six emergency shifts, sorry. Sorry everyone. Please do your best as we do need those resources. ASAP. Come on. We definitely need to build another one of these. And we will need to build another bunker. Okay, temperature is dropping. How are we doing coal wise? We are doing bad. We are doing bad. What are we going? Steam hub efficiency upgrade. We are going for that. So let's let the temperature drop all the way. Let's see what effects that had. Is anything freezing? No, not really. Okay, okay, so we have one more day to research. Oh man, to research the other thingy. Uh, oh man. Oh man, we are in a pickle. <laughs> we are, are in a very big pickle. Um, what's this? Oh, the medical post is inoperative. Okay. Uh, 28 patients are out on the street, so yeah. Let's not do that. Yeah, this doesn't need to work. Is there anything else that has shut down? Shut down. Oh, we have enough materials for another. another for another uh, hunters hunters hangar so yeah let's definitely get that going it's full of wood
content is rising. Not much we can do. Mostly about them. Uh, we are gathering a lot of raw food, which is what we need. We will maybe barely do that. Maybe. Oh wait, these guys are freezing. Ah oh, shit, man. These guys are freezing, which means that we won't be able to... Oh, and these guys are very cold as well. So, we definitely need more houses. Or, let's go, let's go, let's get this into overdrive mode. For a little while, that will stave off the cold for a little while, but not much longer. And we definitely need these materials, come on guys, come on. Have we built uh, the new... nope, we have not, so this one come, won't come in time. We're not doing great on coal either. Some shit. Th these guys are going to freeze. Uh, unless... Oh, this is al already at level 2 range. It's heating hunter's huts. They don't need... They don't need heat though. Uh, we'll definitely need to... Uh, reach it out, or maybe we can just transfer them over here, right? This is this just costs a bit of wood, so tech workshop. Oh wow, there's not that much space though. I guess we have to endure it. Recall all scouts and outpost teams. Aren't you in the city? Recalled the outpost. Oh, how are we doing? Okay, so view map, this band, this band. We suddenly got a good, a good boost of wood. Still need that steel, though. Uh, okay, good. Uh, these guys are arriving in 11 minutes, so they will most definitely arrive in time. Um, what else can we do? Uh, not much, I guess, except gather materials. This is not getting built, so yeah, there is that. What happens if we if we get the range down? Will the range go down here too? No, nope, it's the same range. What happens? Oh, these guys have arrived. guys have arrived so we can disband them how are we doing coal wise okay we're still burning we're still losing coal but we are losing at the lesser rate uh, we're not gonna be able to gather enough food oh we're we're building that great 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 that is awesome that is awesome let's try to go for yet another one see if we can get one last hunt in before uh, before everything goes to hell okay can we build another depot can build another resource depot, so let's do that. Uh, where are the other ones? Over here, maybe? Yep. Over here.
all teams back in city, everyone with a mission away from the city is back and safe. It's possible to be safe from the cold coming our way, that is. Alright, let's get this show on the road people please. We do need to stockpile raw food. Can we? Couldn't we sign a law where where soup would not soup would not uh, manage? Oops, soup. Come on. Can, soup would not uh, make people nearly as discontent. Organic fertilizer soup. Uh, moonshine. Maybe every meal slightly lowers discontent. Eating soup causes less discontent. Yeah, this is the one. But people will get drunk, so I'm not so sure. Um, so I'm not so sure that's what we need right now. All right, come on, quickly. Build that quickly. We need we need that hunt going out. Hopefully one last hunt uh, will do it. Hopefully. Steam hub efficiency upgrade. Research. Okay, how are we doing on coal? Alright, that efficiency upgrade did it. Very nice. Very nice. Now, we will need to research the level 4. The overdrive will just last for another day. Um, so yeah, let's wait up a bit then. Hmm. The overdrive will just last for another day. Hmm. We are done for. <laughs> we are very much done for. Drive last for another day. Um, is there any way that we can make... Uh, I no, I don't think so. Our top priority should be to gather resources and... Okay, let's get some workers going, going on there. Severe frostbite. Okay, let's get another one. Citizen had to be amputated. Can we upgrade the efficiency of this? No. We need to gather enough steel. Uh, okay, so if we can go on this one last hunt, we just might be able to have enough food. Uh, let's see. How much food are we collecting? 565 per day? What? How, how did it drop? How did we create that? We just created a new one and it dropped. What? That that makes no sense. That makes absolutely no sense. Come on, gather that steel a little bit faster. There's nothing else we can do until, until we have gathered that steel. able to do it just in the nick of time if we're able to go out on that last hunt oh, these guys are returning how many guys do we have building here one hour left Some more 24 hour shifts. 
guys let's build this waiting for workers Is there nobody available come on guys we need that last hunt we definitely need that last hunt Rest time. Work is done for the day. 50 percent efficiency there they are going okay looks like we'll be able to do one last hunt nice Very nice. Uh, this is still waiting for workers. Weird. And this about six hours. What? What? Is there nobody else available to help build that? Go gather food, my friends. Okay, this is getting built. Sixty percent efficiency. Okay, this will go for raw food. Resource depot. Huh. Why is that? Why is this one bigger though? Okay, 90% efficiency. Let's get going, guys. We need lots and lots of raw food. Okay. Get going. How many? Seven, six absences. What? What? Is that like nobody that's not sick? Oh man. Okay, we have enough resources to start researching this. And let's also build a workshop. Let's build a workshop here. Actually, let's build a couple of them. Um, okay. Let's build a couple of them here. How much food are we going to be able to bring in? 600 raw food. I still don't think that's going to be enough, but that's all we can do. Alright, let's save game. And hopefully this will be enough, hopefully. shifts are in order sorry about that but we need to get that research going are they leaving oh, they are gathering food good can we get get another 24 hour research going uh, I guess uh, oh these are being built let's let's do this because this won't be freezing six hours left what three hours left okay five hours two hours. Okay, we 
we just we might be able to do it just in the nick of time we'll see okay let's get these engineers out of here get them there well, let's get another engineer dropping from here get them there work and another 24 hour shift I am so sorry for that my friends but we need to we need that research ASAP okay let's get them all out of here and one more out of there get them there uh, we'll probably need to risk yet another 24 hour shift Six, thirty-seven. So yeah, that is it. Hopefully that was enough, enough food. Probably not though. How many six absences? Three. All right, we're, ha we're halfway there, and we will need to turn off. We will also need to build some more houses. Uh, we can build a couple of them, right? Let's, let's build another house. Ooh, we there's another one fits there, which is good. Um, we also need to make sure that we have enough materials to research the generator uh, power upgrade. see how that goes the city. A howling gale bursts upon the city and the generator creaks and groans under the weight of the wind. Pale faces turn towards rattling windows, trembling lips utter words for prayer. The cold will be brutal, hunting is impossible, the soil in the hothouses will freeze. We'll have to make do with the food we've stockpiled. The city must survive. Survive the storm. We've done what we could to prepare. We didn't finish in time, but now it doesn't matter. Be wary of falling temperature and survive until the end of the storm. How are we doing the temperature? Is there anything that has stopped working? I don't think so. Okay, uh, this won't last much longer. Come on, researcher guys. We need your... We need you. Okay, 990 raw food. Okay, uh, level 4. Let's start. And the remaining resources will go towards building houses. Does not need. This guy does not need. This guy definitely needs. How are we doing here? Okay, we're doing good. How much? How much time? Twelve hours at one hundred percent research rate. Holy moly! This is gonna get tough because we will. We are going. We're going to have to shut down the overdrive. Uh, right about now.
level is at a critical level we have to turn the overdrive off the overdrive now shit shit okay ah shit what stopped working okay this we can deal with this the cook house that's okay uh, this is an operative that's okay these guys are freezing uh, we'll just have to deal with that get this back to work and we can get this back to work the house has stopped working that's okay it's okay and temperature will keep dropping oh wow how are we going to deal with that uh, is this inoperative okay no it's just freezing but we do need that steel Let's keep building houses. Uh, is this a tent? Yeah, it's definitely a tent. Okay, 20%. We'll be able to do it this today. I'm not sure. I am not sure. Oh, this didn't do much. Okay. This is an operative, that is okay. Closed. Oh, wait! We can still send. Wait, 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 wait. We can still send hunters' hangers out. Can we still. We can still hunt? Well, if we can. That's a game changer. Oh no, we cannot. Okay. Food. Raw food game. Oh, we can still hunt. So what the hell? What the hell? What the hell? So, not much we can do until we get that researched. Still hunt. Wait, what's going on here? The cook house is inoperative. Uh, this is inoperative, but that's okay. That's okay. That's actually very okay. Let's get the engineers out of there. Let's get them working here. Uh, that won't do much. To see if we can research this a, a wee bit faster. How are we doing coal wise? Uh, we're not losing that much coal per day, believe it or not. Double 007 Gamer, welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for joining us. Oh, this looks like the beginning of the end game. How many will freeze? <laughs> well, I don't know. Uh, I was rip overdrive. May you live to burn another day. I'm pretty sure you can't go out and hunt. Uh, says it when it starts that people can't leave the pit. Um, yeah, so, but I think we can't go out with hunters, but it does look like that the hangers, the flying hunters, can still go out. Because check this out, these guys, the hunters' hangers, are not inoperative. Oh, this one is. Okay, so never mind that. Maybe we can't. I thought that we could hunt. Close at this time of the day, but it doesn't say that it's inoperative. But this one is, for some reason. Huh, maybe we can't. Still, the food tab says we're still gathering 495 raw food per day, which is weird. Uh, we'll see. Uh, we're making a run for it to research the generator power of grade 3 so that we can keep the people uh, heated. Mild frostbite. Okay, we can deal with that. Severe frostbite. We can build more houses. Uh, not bunk houses. Let's build more houses. 
Let's replace these tents. Alright, it looks like we'll be able to do it before the end of this workday, which is great. Alright. Generator. Power 4. Coal, 400% coal consumption, so yeah. Now we need to deal with that. But at least people won't be as freezing as they were. Research. Generator safety bypass. Generator will increase the stress will increase 20 percent 25% lower and fall 25% faster. Oh cool. Uh, that's pretty cool. Let's research the efficiency upgrades next. Uh, although we don't we don't have the resources for that. Uh, but we, we're just six steels short, so we should be able to gather them pretty soon. Uh, depending on what type of meals you are making, I think you have plenty of raw food to last the rest of the game. Um, we are making soup, which means... Uh, actually, we're not making anything right now, because the cookhouses are inoperative due to the cold, but that should turn around as soon as temperature reaches level 4 in the steam generator. Uh, but we are making uh, soup. Uh, that means uh, that we can multiply the raw food by a factor of 2.5. We need we need it nearly 3k. Uh, so yeah, that's not nearly enough. But we do still have these rations. Uh, we'll see. It will be. I don't think we have enough, but it's not. It's not short. Uh, it won't be too short. So and people might be able to have to go. Um, a day without eating, uh, but that's fine. They can they can last a day without eating. Uh, so yeah. Uh, by the way, uh, Double Gamer, how's your migraine doing? Uh, hope it's doing better now. Uh, before we proceed, I'm still not sure if we can absolutely not hunt uh, because these ones are not claiming to be inoperative. So maybe we can still do some hunting, and then we'll have enough food for everyone. We'll see. Uh, yeah, you may not starve to death, I guess. <laughs> uh, we'll see. This is a very tough game, though. Uh, what else? Uh, let me take a five-minute break, and now we'll be right back. Uh, pretty much better today. Thanks for asking. Oh, I'm so glad that you're doing better. Headaches and migraines are not fun at all. So I will take a short five minute break and I will be right back.
we are back thank you so much for waiting thank you so much for watching um let's get right back into it shall we ruckus neil oh uh tempt you dude thank you so much uh snap 85 thank you so much for dropping by Della Rocca, i've got to go see ya thank you so much for watching so far Della Rocca. Uh, thank you so much for moderating i'll see you later my friend Alright, where were we? Uh, we were building houses. So, if we weren't able to hunt, might as well free up the workers, right? Wait. This one doesn't say that it's inoperative. Oh, weird. This one does say that it's inoperative. What are we doing? Okay, let's see. of the workers to start building. Oh, wait. Uh, generator efficiency, this makes... Uh, consumption will be reduced for the 10%. Uh, but actually, the optimal thing to do is to do this one. Because... Uh, coal mines, steam coal mines and advanced coal mines will be another 10% more efficient. Uh, so, yeah. That is what we need. That is what we need. So, three more steel until we can start research again. One more steel, come on. Okay. Alright. Let's get that show on the road. Can we get some workers here? Yes, we can get some workers here. Oh, this is inoperative, no? Now it says that it's inoperative. Okay. Okay, so we won't be able to hunt. Okay, at all. So, yeah. What about this? So, yeah. Uh, no need for that. This one is also inoperative. Uh, do we have enough engineers to staff this? Nope, we do not, unfortunately. Uh, because it's just workers there, right? The ones there were the workers. Today, probably not. Probably not. We have 18 homeless. Can the cook house cook? We can. Okay, so, but we do need to go. Zero value. 
the other Kukhans doing? have any engineers left here? Oh, we do. Let's get them out of there, out of there and then. Let's get them. Let's get them. Let's get them here. Available. Toast, greetings, O7. Greetings, Captain Toast. How are you doing today? Thank you so much for dropping by this stream. Are you a streamer too? Let's see, let's make sure we build enough houses. is doing good. Next we'll probably need the... <sighs> the upgrade to the, to the cook houses so that we can keep cooking for raw food. Okay. 50 people are freezing. Alright. Next up... What is our next objective? Healthcare insulation, we don't need that. House insulation, we will definitely need this. We will definitely need this. Uh, so yeah, with the house insulation and a wee bit of overdrive, we might be able to do it. Might be able to do it. Let's see, resources. Advanced steel works. 50 wood. Uh, we probably should do it. We probably should do it because we do need a bit more steel. Nah, not a streamer as of yet. Your city doesn't look too hot. <laughs> oh, damn. Damn, son, you're gonna freeze. Uh, well, <laughs> in my defense, my city has never looked uh, hot like at all. Hunter's hunt, let's not do that anymore. Free up the workforce. Uh, we have been struggling from, from the get go, uh, but we have been getting by somehow. So, yeah. Yeah, uh, right now not everybody's too hot, uh, but not everybody's too too cold either. We are being able to build houses, which is great. Uh, the bunk houses uh, are going to be the next problem, uh, but we are replacing all the tents with with houses right now. And as soon as temperature drops, what's the plan for that? Housing insulation, right? probably what we need. Houses will be warmer. This one heat level. Yep, that's definitely what we need. Uh, we will need to stockpile some materials in order to get there. To get there though. A couple of houses being built. Okay, we got a couple of 24 hour shifts there. They're still going strong. Uh, we could use the wood. Let's say we could use the wood to, uh, to research stronger sawmills. Uh, not sawmills. I mean, 
this advanced still works. Uh, but we might be too. It might be a, a bit too late for that. Advanced coal mine. This requires three steam cores that we don't have. Uh, what else? Boosted scout sh sleds. No need for that, as we can't scout anything. Uh, heating. Let's see. Generator efficiency upgrade. Definitely need that. How are we doing coal wise? Uh, we're still losing coal. We're still losing coal. I wonder why that is. Why that is. Hmm. Weird. Uh, I thought we had enough of those. Oh well. It is what it is. Okay, Walt really is doing fine. So no more emergency shifts. I guess we're going to turn on the... Uh, uh, the overdrive again. As soon as temperature drops. Until we... Until we have enough materials for... Housing insulation, right? 120 wood and 80 of steel. So we definitely need that. Is there anything that is more that has higher priority? Don't think so. There's really no need to upgrade the hot house as we can't make any food. Your coal production is just way too low for this stage of the game. You think? Uh, we are researching some efficiency upgrades and we just upgraded um, we just upgraded what did we upgrade uh, the, uh, the boosts damn it the steam coal mines and uh, they should be working more efficiently now uh, and just before, during the day we were making enough coal to make the generator work so a couple more upgrades should do it maybe we still we still have more efficiency upgrades that we can do. We can still do this. We could probably go for this. This is just 30 steel. How much steel do we have? 13. Uh, we'll see. Either way we have to. Uh, 15 hours of coal left, generator overheating, no resources, good luck my dude. Generator is not overheating. Uh, generator was overheating, but overdrive is turned off. Uh, so gen uh, the stress levels are going down right now. Uh, so yeah. Uh, but yeah, thank you. Uh, we'll need all the luck that we can get. Uh, this game has been very tough from the get-go. At first we had a food crisis. Uh, we had a food, food crisis at first uh, that we had to solve. Then one what was the second crisis? I don't remember what the second crisis were, but we were struggling for a very long time so we could get the city up and running until very late in the game. So yeah, this is what we got. Well, no point in delaying. No point in delaying. Can we get... do that but that would waste food that we definitely need to survive let's see how our consumption is doing um, let's check this steam hubs are still the generator is not the thing that is oh okay generator is not the thing that is consuming the most coal so next up we should probably not go for that but rather the heaters That's even less resources, so that's great. Uh, but without the house.
houses, houses are chilly, they will get cold uh, in this morning. We'll see. We need more resources. We definitely need more resources. Danger of collapse. Sir, one of our engineers wants to talk to you. He's concerned about the danger the cold poses to our mines. We're doing everything we can to heat, heat the mines, but the air we're pumping into the shafts is so cold now that the hydraulic roof supports are starting to freeze. When they do, the tunnels will start collapsing. Okay. Are you telling me that we won't be able to produce more coal in the mines? That, 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 that sucks. That just sucks, right? Uh, we can't get this coal thumper up and running. We do have enough manpower for that. So that, uh, that might be a solution. Not sure if we have enough space for for the resource gathering thingy. Uh, but maybe that might be a solution that we will have to implement. JB Sebastian says, GG, yeah, we, this might be the end for us. Uh, we will uh, we will try to do everything we can uh, to survive, of course. This might be the end. We have survived two bleak situations before during this playthrough, uh, but we'll see. Uh, anyways, um, thank you all for watching. This is all the time I have to play right now. We will be back with more some more Frostpunk tomorrow morning. Please check out the schedule below. Uh, if you haven't done so, please follow this channel for more enforcement action. And I will see you all next time. And until next time, game on!